Taking stock of the situation, the Ministry of Home Affairs is now sending four more companies, which means 400 additional central troops will now be sent to Darjeeling. Let me know, now go across to my colleague Nikunj, who joins us live on this story. Nikunj, now every day we are seeing that the situation in Darjeeling is getting from bad to worse. So MHA is going to send more forces there. Well, yes, Hina, unfortunately, the situation is still not completely in the grip of the uh, local administration. And clearly, if the Ministry of Home Affairs is intervening on a day-to-day -day basis and sending additional central paramilitary troops to uh, the uh, strife town areas, then for sure the state government's law enforcement apparatus also has not been effectively able to get a grip on the situation. And uh, the uh, inadequacy of the state administration is clearly reflecting on their day-to-day -day demands for central troops. Nonetheless, in the later tranche, which is the third tranche of deployment of the central troops, the third set of deployment of the central troops, 400 additional central uh, uh, para paramilitary forces men are being deployed. The decision has just been taken and these troops should be in Darjeeling and adjoining areas wherever the state government chooses to deploy them by tomorrow early morning. Nonetheless, the problem is that the inadequacy of the law enforcement apparatus there would not only be fulfilled by the central troops because remember these troops would remain alien to the top topography, uh, alien to the language, alien to the overall lay of the land and the effective deployment of these troops as well as their marriage with the local law enforcement machinery will all depend on the effective steps being taken by the local state administration. That is something that Ministry of Home Affairs at this point of time clearly feels is not being adequately done. Yes.